this rant, I'm going to share five things to not do in LinkedIn discussions or in social media uh, in, in general. Okay, so point number one is don't derail discussions with solicitations. I've uh, covered this in some detail. This is where uh, people who don't really fully understand our industry come in and and uh, and uh, take over a thread by offering suggestions uh, when, in a discussion that's just like not cool. Uh, don't muck up a topic thread. Okay, so this is where uh, a discussion's going on. It's a productive discussion, and somebody comes in out of the nowhere with some completely diff different discussion. The answer here is simple. Just start a new discussion. For those of you who don't understand how to do that, at the top of LinkedIn, where it says discussion, you hit a plus, and then you can start a new discussion instead of uh, taking over somebody else's uh, thread. That that would be, be good. Now, uh, point number three is don't contribute content that's irrelevant. Okay, most of the networking I do and the groups I participate in are industry groups made up of distributors and suppliers. And so when somebody is asking for some product ideas, uh, what I see more and more is distributors that are jumping in trying to sell other distributors using, of course, the same sources uh, that we all have. It just makes no sense. So uh, my suggestion is to be aware of the group that uh, that you're in. If it's an industry discussion, there's no point in a distributor trying to sell a distributor. Now, along these lines, I casually mention that very lovingly in a forum, suggesting to a distributor that they might want to uh, post their services in a group that is made up of end users rather than trying to sell their peers that have access to the same sources. Well, um, uh, that wasn't received too well, and that brings me to uh, 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 the other point here, which is uh, don't use social media to tear down relationships. So in this case, when I suggested that they post in uh, into a group that's geared towards end users instead of their colleagues, I received a very nice personal message that said, and by the way, you are a jackass. Okay, so what they've done is they've torn down a relationship that didn't really exist. And what's the point of that? Because social media is really all about uh, people helping each other. Uh, uh, point number four here is... is uh, Make sure you're adding connections that make sense. Okay, how many of you guys have gotten a uh, request to be connected and it's from some uh, car wash across the country uh, that, that somebody you know is related to or a cleaner, you know, this type of thing. These are not productive connections. So uh, make sure you're connecting with people that, uh, you know, make sense to have a relationship with. And on that topic, I would suggest not using... Uh, the generic, uh, I'd like to add you to my professional network, make a personal message if it's somebody that you've encountered at a trade show, so it's uh, just a little more uh, warm and fuzzy. And uh, lastly is y you need to give uh, before you can get. I'm a big fan of, of helping other people. That's why I created free promo tips. I was helped when I came into this industry, and so uh, it's all about really helping one another and in one case uh, there was a distributor that was on a forum and he came and said hey you know I, I've been given some ideas and I haven't gotten any business and I think uh, that that I should be paid for these ideas if they're used in a deal well uh, you know that's kind of not the way it works there it's a uh, you know social media has, has a bigger picture it's all about sort of helping each other and uh, so those are my five things not to do in social uh, media and if you want to uh, learn more about how I've learned about this. Uh, one of the programs I've, I've participated in is the Marking Animals. It's, it's quite amazing. You can email uh, Jeff at freepromotips.com and I'll get you some information on that. There's tons of great content available. Thanks for watching and make it a great day.